Let's hope you just put it like this and then you talk. Alright, uh, welcome guys. We're doing the top 16 for the RGB. Press start tournament. Oh, okay, let's switch mic. You can wear it anyhow as long as the mic is in front of your face. Hello, hello. Hello, am okay. I, am, I, am I on? Yeah, you're on. No, I don't think so. I don't hear my. I can you're hear not, you. You're not supposed to hear anything. It's just a mic. <laughs> okay, so I can't hear All you. Alright, uh. so up first we have uh, Cien versus uh, Sherman. Sherman. Arguably the best bison that we have. But today he's going to play guard because of matchup. In terms of matchup experience against uh, Cien again, because bison is not a good matchup. Against Sien Gen. Sien was saying against that. Against Gen, yeah. <coughs> yes, because Sien was saying that he loves fighting bison. <laughs> yeah, he said that because he can easily jump in on the bison yeah. and with all his ambiguous cross ups and setups, so it's easier to fight bison. And Sherman is actually a charge character player, he so is. he's very he's well versed to, in. He's gone to Guile. Yes, he's gone to Guile. Which is a better matchup. It's, a, it's a, technically a very good matchup for 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 Guile, but uh, Sien is so familiar with this matchup, may not work out in his favor here. Well, it's still a bad matchup. So yeah, but it's definitely a bad matchup. Definitely, there is a still in terms of experience, or rather in matchups ex matchup experience, it would be Guile advantage. But clearly, Sien is able to handle this really easily. He's playing yeah. with game out. Dominion, but yeah. I guess it's still I, I, worth in a In my opinion, matchup knowledge is more more important than the matchup itself. Agree, agree. Yeah. And we also have to take note that matchup experience is still a key factor in winning games. Yep. And Sien took the first game, first round, I mean. Okay. Oh, if that ambiguous cross up, you don't know where to block left or right. And Gao just has to play really, really defensively. Throwing booms. Trying to down heavy punch. Oh, it's, it's the infamous Sien setup. Sien is so close to taking victory here. Focus back dash, biding his time, switching stance, focusing. Oh, baits that ex flash kick. Is he gonna do another setup? Oh, good stuff. Medium punch Sien. buffer into the hundred hands. Okay, I don't know, really know what you call that. But we have to double click on the results now. Alright, so going back to Captain Slack. Sherman thinks, you know, maybe Gao wasn't the best choice. So I'll have to go back to my main. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess anything's worth a try against yeah, the yeah. top player. So Sherman goes back to basics with his main bison, best bison in Singapore, yeah. arguably. B League player. Yep. And now, let's see what he can do. Combining his time, hit, doing hit storms, whipping hit storms. It's going to be really, really difficult for Sherman. And he's uh, both very cautious. Yeah. Oh, he gets the medium kick. See this? And he gets the slide. Oh, that's ambiguous. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of what I mean, right? You are so much more familiar with playing your own character, even if it's a bad matchup. Like, sometimes it's better just to play the character, you know? Yeah, your main. Because at this level, matchups, when if you're a good player, you, re you really know how to deal with all your you, bad matchups. You should know how to deal with yeah. them. Yeah. So, at this level, matchups are really something of a, like a, maybe a thing of a past. <laughs> That's not a very on honest opinion. Yeah, yeah. It's like you go to Japan, all the Sagats, all the Zangus can play with the Sagats. It's true. So, oh, it's pretty even right now. I think Sherman is faring better with Bison as compared to He's definitely Gao. faring a lot better. Yeah. It, was, it was pretty free just now with uh, Gao. He has a, still has a chance even though he's slightly 
not in the live lead. But the thing about Gen is I don't really know which stand is which. What does each stand do? Yeah, ah, neither see, do I. You see the the mid jump, medium kick. You don't yeah. know which stand does it, does that ambiguous cross up. <laughs> you can't really see. It, you gotta play against him though. You have to play against him, yeah. Oh, we think that Kara troll. Oh, hangs in the air with that uppercut. Trying to bait uh, a response from Sherman, I think. Yeah, you just have to press something and another leg, another leg comes off. Yep. And you don't really dare to hit any, do anything exactly. when Gen is in the air because you don't know when he's going to hit something yep. out of the blue. And then oh. you feel really dumb for trying. Yeah. <laughs> Gen has a really nice sweep. Oh, I love that punch, heavy punch. Oh, Sien is, as, you, as you can see, is trying to do that down medium kick buffer into that 100 hands. Yep. Now he's got a super meter, so he's gonna save that super meter for an ultra setup. And he was gonna do a lot of focus attacks here to try and get an ultra meter coming. It, yeah, if he does get it, it's pretty much uh, over if he gets hit at all. <laughs> yeah, if he gets full ultra meter, it's an easily 6%. Oh, he's got it now. Oh, he gets the setup. Does an uppercut. And he's gonna do another jump in. Oh, oh and Bigos cross it. up there. So Sherman's on the ropes here. This is the loser's bracket, so uh, this is Sherman's tournament life here on the line. Wow, oh my reaction. god, reaction from Sien. Oh, you are. You get that. Oh. And time over. So Sien takes, takes it quite comfortably. And up next, we're gonna try get another match, a good match for you guys.